that's pretty interesting out here. Mm, let's see what sound. Yeah, oh, ow, ow, ow. Oh, man. Hey, what did I just fall in? Yeah, this ground drops pretty fast. Uh, Linkser? Huh. Do you have any idea what you're standing in? Uh, no, not really. Come up here, yeah, that way you can get a better view. Okay, what am I looking at here? It's a dinosaur track. Yeah, oh, okay, I see it. I see it, yeah, it's a dinosaur track. Wait, I just fell into a dinosaur track. I can't believe that fortune cookie was right. Oh my gosh, this is, I don't know if you guys can see it. Can you guys see it? Okay, look, we're gonna point the outline. So here's the heel right here. And then if you come right here, this area right here is one toe claw. Right here, this is one toe. And then if you come right here, here's another toe right here. And then come right here, this is a third toe. So we are, this is a three-toed dinosaur, probably a theropod. Yeah, it's probably, it looks like a theropod track to me, or maybe it's from a hadrosaur. Some kind of hadrosaur, so I don't know if you guys can see it, but can you see it? Yeah, I see it. It's my little... Oh, okay, God. Oh, here's a better view. You see it? I think you can see it so... See it so right here. And right there. And then right here. And then the heel is right here. So here's the dinosaur track. What do you think, guys? I don't know. It's either from a hadrosaur or maybe some kind of theropod. Like maybe an archocanthosaurus? like the dinosaur that we saw at the Phoenix Museum of Natural History. Maybe it's an Albertosaurus footprint, like what we saw at the New Mexico Museum of Natural History and Science. But yeah, these are the dinosaur tracks right beneath Mount Crystal Ray in El Paso, Texas. Let's see if we could find more, but I don't know if you guys could see it. Yeah, that's a dinosaur track right there. So out here, there used to be dinosaurs and we're not very far from the border to Mexico. So let's walk around and see if we could find more. Oh, this track right here is really perfect. Yeah, it's very good. If you point the camera right here, you can see it a lot better. Do you see it? Okay, follow my finger. Here's one toe. There's another toe. Here's another toe. And then right here is the heel. Right here. So these dinosaur feet are a little over a foot long. I'd say about a foot, maybe a foot and a half. So yeah, what do you guys think? Theropods or maybe hadrosaurs? I don't know, because I remember seeing a fossilized footprint of a hadrosaurus at the museum in Phoenix. Those were three toes. And by the looks of it, there was more than one dinosaur out here. So these tracks were made by more than one dinosaur. So it was probably an entire herd of hadrosaurs. But yeah, if you can see this track, this track is really good right here. Okay, if we come up here. Yeah, I see it. I see it real good. Follow my finger. Here's one toe. There's another toe. And here's another toe. Right here is the heel. So yeah, that's a pretty good one right there. Oh yeah, I see it. Much better view right here. See, right here, here's one toe right here. And then there's the other toe, here's the other toe, and then the heel. So yeah, this one's probably one of the best tracks we can find out here. So yeah, these tracks are 97 million years old and they were barely discovered in 2003. And then somewhere out there is Mount Crystal Ray. You just can't see it from where we're at because we're at a kind of in, on lower ground right now. But yeah, this dinosaur track is real good right here. So yeah, he looks like he's walking up that way. So yeah, this one's a pretty good track. And then we're actually, we actually think that according to what we read, this area out here used to actually be a prehistoric beach. It used to be all wet and mucky, but over the millennia, this land has been altered over the course of that millennia. And then there's another one over there that looks like he's walking in the opposite direction of this guy. So yeah, if you guys don't know what we're talking about, 
let's come over here so you see this track he looks like he's walking up that way up the mountain but if you come over here this dinosaur track looks like he's walking the opposite direction of the other guy so let's put us down right here and I bet you can see it right here yeah here's one toe there's another toe here's another toe and right here is the heel of the dinosaur track so yeah, we are actually walking with dinosaurs right now. Who knows, we might be walking amongst our ghosts right now. But yeah, this one, this track is also really good. See how he's walking compared to that guy over there. That guy looks like he's walking this way. And then this guy looks like he's walking that way. So it's probably a group of hadrosaurs who are just hanging out out here. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's we found another track right here. I don't know if you guys can see it, but if follow my finger. Here's one toe right here, and then here's another toe right here, and then here's a third toe right here, and then the heel comes down to right here. So if you take a look at it from a different angle, you could probably see it. And I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but we see them, they're big, and they're three-toed dinosaurs, so either a theropod or some kind of hadrosaurus. Yeah, you guys see it? Yeah, I definitely see it right here, right here, and right here. Pretty big dinosaur tracks. I, I'm gonna guess it's most likely from a hadrosaurus, because we're looking at all the footprints and it appears to be like a, an entire herd of dinosaurs came walking through here. So it was probably a herd of hadrosaurs that came walking through here. But yeah, I don't know if you guys can see the tracks. And then take a look at these lines right here appear to be a very dark red so yeah here's one toe here's another toe and then here's another toe you guys can see it yeah looking at it from the camera I don't know if you guys can see it but we're pointing them out for you so you get so you get a picture of what we're looking at yeah I think you guys can see this one a little bit better follow the finger there's one track right one claw right here another claw right there let's see Yep, I see it. One claw, two claw, three claws. So if you wanna... So here's one claw right here. There's one toe. Come right here, here's another toe. And then here's the third toe right here. And you come right here and right here is the heel. Right here. So this sounds a pretty big dinosaur track. And then right behind us is another one. So he took one step from right here from another step to right there. If you guys can make it out. Some tracks are easier to make out than others. But you gotta remember that this land was altered over the millennia. And these tracks are about 97 million years old. So these are some pretty old tracks. 97 million year old tracks and they were first discovered in 2003. Just take one last look at it, see it? One toe, two toes, three toes. So yeah, it goes like that. So yeah, it's pretty cool that we got to walk out here amongst the ancient land and where dinosaurs used to roam. And we're not very far from the border of Mexico, it's right over there. So these dinosaurs probably walked from the United States and into Mexico. And this is during the late Cretaceous time period. So yeah, we're walking amongst 97 million, 97 million year old Cretaceous time period dinosaur tracks. So these are pretty old. So yeah, it's pretty cool that we got to walk amongst the ancient footprints of prehistoric dinosaurs. So from where we were just looking at the dinosaur tracks, all the dinosaur tracks are right down there. Down there in that area. So yeah, a lot of fossilized dinosaur tracks down there. And then right over there, you can see it right there on the other side of that large rock is Mount Crystal Ray right there. So that's Mount Crystal Ray and then Mexico is right over there. So we're not too far from the border. So yeah, all down there are fossilized dinosaur tracks. So yeah, it's pretty cool that we got to come out here and visit it. So that's it for now, folks. So thank you for watching. Please be sure to like, share, content, subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And we'll see you guys later.